Okay, so I know for a fact that many of you are probably going to request me to react to this video because it came out recently on the main channel, Durian Fruit vs. The Angry Grandpa. So, this came out a few days ago. I've seen the title and of course a little bit of it, but I hadn't seen the whole thing. But, we're going to get into this video and we're going to see how it goes. This is for you guys, wrong clip now. A couple of months ago, Angry Grandpa tried to prank us by giving us a piece of durian fruit. Which oh, I remember that one, it's in this vlog. Supposedly the smelliest fruit in existence. <laughs> And of course, for those who are a fan of Super Mario Sunshine, they also have the durian fruit in Isle Dolfino, where the Dolfino people, the city folk, eat durians, which I don't know what it tastes like, but personally though, I'd rather stick with pineapple, in my opinion. Turns out he gave us a jackfruit and an all <laughs> Well, today I got one. <laughs> I'm going to tell him it's called a pork of pineapple. Pork pineapple? What kind of name is? I guess it makes sense because, well, you can see that it has those thorns outside. <laughs> oh, I can pretty much guarantee it's going to be a very crazy one. Let's see how it turns out. I remember this one. They brought it to this house, but I didn't see what else he did with it. I got this far. <laughs> it's not a pineapple. Ooh! Who was that? Charlie. Uh. Oh! <laughs> oh no! Um. Is that a sword? That's a pretty nifty blade. Jesus. He's gonna break into that thing. God dang! Oh, I'm breaking his sword for one thing. That durian is strong. <laughs> oh. You got another weapon? That stuff's got a tough grind on it. Strong fruit versus angry what grandpa himself. Oh. What the? <laughs> <laughs> it's a durian. <laughs> My God. If he opens it more, it's gonna freak him out. Oh, that blade. Oh. <laughs> He just <laughs> he threw up. My God, that small knife's doing something. It's, it has some dentimate to it. Oh my! <laughs> he got drove there, man. <laughs> oh, yo, my. <laughs> that is so nasty. Oh my god. That's a good sign to let people know that during it is not a very excellent fruit to go with. I go with pineapple because pineapple is good. And without pineapple, you have no pineapple juice, you have no pineapple to eat as a snack or whatever for breakfast in the morning as a breakfast fruit. Anything you can think of. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Jesus. Christ. <laughs> He's going crazy. <laughs> Holy shrimp. <laughs> he didn't hurt. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, I would not want that in my house. <laughs> it was your idea, Michael. <laughs> oh, he pierced the mess. Oh, dang. <laughs> I'm pretty much glad I'm not there. Holy shrimp. 
not a porcupine. Oh. <coughs> oh. Oh my god. <laughs> you don't know what a dirty is. That's what you gave Michael and Bridget. Yeah. You remember trying to play gas and he gave us what you thought was. Uh huh. Yeah, there it is. That's the real one. <laughs> Although it is not more stinkier compared to acorn squash. Yeah, now some certain vegetables have a different type of odor, but what you would do is the obvious. Just kind of clean them out. Like, for instance, acorn squash that looks like pumpkin, needless to say. Just cut it in half, and of course you had the scent. Get the seeds out, and of course, well, maybe the seeds, and of course the uh, chunky stuff that's inside the vegetable has that scent in it. Just scoop it out and throw it away. Simple. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh, Jesus! Holy! Oh. He freaking pulverized that durian, man! Oh! He's about to have juice everywhere! Ah! <laughs> Serves <laughs> 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 you right, Michael. That was your idea from the get go. I'm sorry. <laughs> Dang, man. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, look at that slop. <laughs> that is too freaking unsightly. Michael's gags are priceless. <laughs> oh my god. Michael's like, forget this mess. It was nuts itself. Never try durian. Because what? I've seen some. i seen another thumbnail pertaining to durian, but I'm not getting into that. But there you go. Durian Fruit vs. Angry Grandpa Reaction by Silver Reploid CLA. Despite earlier, this rather gave me a thrill. And of course, uh. Yeah, I really had a very excellent thrill with this video to react to for you guys because you guys have been probably requesting me to react to it. So, uh, there you have it. The reaction of Durian Fruit versus Angry Grandpa. And of course, well, I'm thinking, uh, I did hear Michael saying something about some for Charlie's channel. I might check that out. Maybe it's due to the aftermath, or I don't know. But if not, then the aftermath will probably be posted on Michael's channels. I don't know for certain, but. I've been seeing Michael's vlogs recently, so I don't know for certain, but I'll be on the lookout for the aftermath. So, there you go, guys. The reaction to Durian Fruit versus Angry Grandpa once again. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button because it keeps me going. Also, make sure you subscribe to the Angry Grandpa Show and, of course, the other channels that work with the Angry Grandpa Show. And if you're new to this channel, make sure to subscribe for more content. Make sure to follow my social media. Also, join me on Twitch tonight where I'll be playing some Donkey Kong Country 2, requested by one of my fellow moderators, needless to say. But, anyway, yep. So... If you want to join my community, the links in the description below. And don't forget to share because here. Make sure to leave a comment and favorite. When this comes soon, this is Super Reploids CLA. Let the Reploids to the fullest, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Hi there, Reploids. This is Super Reploids CLA. I wanted to take the time to say thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. And if you want more content, please subscribe. Don't forget to follow my social media for more updates. And in case you missed it, please check out my previous video or any video displayed. And please give tons of love and support. I look forward to seeing you at the Utopia, my dear Reploids.